Hey guys, Jack here with another video. I'm gonna do a recap of uh, this box that broke today. An older box, 1991 Fleer football. Uh, I went to my house to get some stuff for my nephew. My nephew, sorry, my cousin. Because my uh, uncle has me get some stuff for him every year. He's only three, so I've been for the past couple years and he pays me back. But uh, So my, he has some older box in my LCS of football, basketball, and baseball. This was the cheapest, so picked it up, 15 bucks. Uh, 36 packs of box, 14 cards a pack. Picked up because of this, basically the Pro Visions cards. They sell pretty well in uh, PSA 10s. So, yeah, I figured I'd pick one up, see if I can get anything good to grade. Here's the packs look like. Keep this one for my pack collection. <clears throat> they don't really tell you the odds, which I would hope they would, but you know, it makes sense for their wax packs. But, yep. So, let's get it, uh, into it. Here are some like the non noble vet base, really. There. And basically, just another stack that size. That stuff I'm gonna put a, use as basically like shipping fodder. It's like cardboard to protect my cards when I ship them out, so it's, ha, it serves a purpose. Uh, next, I'll flip quickly flip through some of the, uh, you know, like notable base, but like not guys are going like quarter box or something. Some of these guys were looked at for grading. Basically, this stack right here, there's another another portion of this stack that was not, but uh, yeah, this is the design green with the photo, the background's blurred out, just a single color. Um, it's kind of an ugly card, not gonna lie. And also, a lot of them were really, really off-centered. So, yeah. Like, you can look at this Derek Thomas top to bottom, mostly. But yeah, I'll flip through these quick. Here's some... This stack's a dec of decent players, but still gonna be probably my 10-cent boxes or whatever. So we got... Tim Brown, Andre Reid, Boomer, Howie Long, Herschel Walker, Art Monk, Okoye, Munoz, another Herschel Walker there, Frank Minifield, Cortez Kennedy. Uh, Charles Haley, there's some, this is substitute of the hitters. So Haley, Randall Cunningham, and also the league leader subset. Mike Singletary, Moran Moon, Steve Atwater, Mark Salen, and Derek Thomas. Uh, Derek Thomas might be in the wrong spot, actually. Because, uh, actually, yeah, let me go through this stuff. I also put all the, I don't really know how to tell if there's rookies, there probably is some rookies in the, here, I just don't really know, but uh, here's some of like the other, like Jets, Giants, subsets, there's these all pro inserts, like Greg Towns in there, and some like even more notable players, I also put all the bills in here, and you know, like the hitters, you know, Ricky Sanders, uh, Ken, Ken Hull, uh, all pro, Icky Woods you got there, Bill Romanowski, Altoon, Eric Metcalf, Jack Del Rio, uh, you know, Mark Duper, Ernest Givens. I believe this is a rookie. No, it's, uh, it's obviously college uni. So I, I, I could tell that one was, but. Metcalf again, Pepper Johnson. <clears throat> Dave Meggett, Scott Norwood. Let's put him in there because obviously the Giants tie in. Uh, Jim Everett, Andre Tippett. I don't think it might be a Hall of Famer, honestly. Dave Krieg, uh, you know, Steve DeBerg, Ray Childress, Bruce Armstrong, Tommy Age, I just do that because same name as a former Mets player. Neil Anderson. Uh, here's, here's what the first All-Pro card I got. Keith Jackson. And here's the design for these, I guess I'll show off. Silver, a better photo in the back. Uh, Jackie Slater there. Mervyn Fryer, Mark Rippian, Gary Anderson. It was a good kicker. And next, we'll get into some of the, uh, also probably going like 10 cent box, I guess, too. Uh, next, I'll show off the uh, PC card they got. So, I'll start with the Sam Mills card, just because he was my dad's favorite player. So I have a small PC of him. And then some of the Chargers, basically. Got Seau, that's nice. Leslie O'Neill hitters, and Leslie O'Neill base. And let's go through these real quick. Marion Butts, you saw there. Anthony Miller, Billy Joe Tolliver. So, yep. Yeah. And next, we'll get into the, here, these are quarter cards first. I'll go in my quarter box. A lot of the better names and some of the, like, the names I had, like, these, they're in the subsets. we got Thurman Thomas, Aikman, Thurman Thomas, Steve Young, Emmett, Thurman Thomas, Bo, Bruce Smith, Derek, yeah, Derek Thomas, Emmett Smith, Bo Jackson, Mike Singletary. There's the other Derek Thomas from before. Let's go in my quarter box. Here's uh, 50 cent cards, I believe. Yeah. 50 cent cards. <clears throat> Barry Sanders. 
Deion Sanders, these are the top, top dogs, you know. Dan Marino, Jerry Rice, Barry Sanders, Reggie White, a couple of those. Reggie White hitters, pretty cool. Uh, Barry Sanders league leaders, Lawrence Taylor. Joe Montana league leaders, Barry Sanders league leaders. Joe Montana base, Joe Montana base, and a Lawrence Taylor base. And then so a couple of dollar cards right here. Uh, couple, you know, both of the same player. Got a lot of this player in this box. Uh, Lawrence Taylor hitters. I live in New York, he's very popular. Hitters, it's a subset. So I got a couple of his base. This one. I also got this Lawrence Taylor right here. The insert, all pro. Very nice, the best all pro card we got by far. Actually, that's not true. Uh, Cause I still haven't shown. Uh, so those are the dollar cards. And then there's four cards I think look good enough to grade. Of the players I consider grading. So first off, we have this Dan Marino base. It's off-centered, but I still think it's okay. I don't know. I Second thought, I might not. I probably won't send this in on second thought. But it does look, the corners look perfect. And the back looks perfect. The back has a lot of chipping and lows. These cards, this one looks very clean. It is off-center, though. Pretty bad. So I'm probably not going to send this in on second thought. But uh, then these three, ones, these three look pretty good. So we have two more of the all-pro inserts. This one's a little off-center, but not bad. And the corners look good. Uh, Barry Sanders. That's pretty cool. Back looks good, too. Um, we have another all-pro insert of Jerry Rice. This one looks much looks better centered. And the corners also look good. The back looks just as good. So that's really sweet too. And then we did get one Pro Visions. And it does have a guy who I said we got a lot of in this box. So I'm pretty happy about that. A Lawrence Taylor Pro Visions. So pretty cool, nice insert there. I'm very happy with that. It's in solid condition. It's actually very, very well centered, surprisingly. So I'm really happy with that. The corners look pretty good too. So I'm happy about that. So overall, decent box. Uh, you know, nothing crazy. Hoping, I thought, I was thinking that we would get more of the provisions, but only one. And it's a shame that so many cars were off-centered really bad, so. And what can you do? But overall, I'm content. Thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, subscribe, and I am out.